Hello students, here is the sixth or number six of the easy listening and reading comprehension exercises. This one is about Mahalid, Muhammad Ali, a very famous fighter. Okay. Cassius Clay was 12 years old and lived in Louisville, Kentucky. One day his new bike was stolen. In tears, he told Officer Joe Martin, I'm going to whip the person who stole my bike. Joe said, well, I'd better teach you how to fight. Joe Martin was the boxing coach at the Columbia Gym. Cassius Clay went to the Columbia Gym and learned to fight. He trained hard. When he was 15, he wore heavy boots and shadow box on the street. He raced school buses and drank raw eggs in his milk. He loved boxing. He wanted to go to the Olympics. Cassius Clay was very polite and religious. After school, he worked in the Nazareth College Library. When the boxing team went to other towns, Clay always stayed in his hotel room and read his Bible. In 1958, he wanted to go to the Olympic trials in San Francisco. There was one problem. Clay was afraid to fly. He decided to buy a parachute and wear it on the plane. During the flight, he prayed in the aisle. At the 1960 Olympics in Rome, Clay won the gold medal. In 1964, he became the world heavyweight champion. Soon after that, he converted to Islam and changed his name to Muhammad Ali. Ali refused to go to war in Vietnam and his title was taken away. He won his title back in 1974 when he fought George Foreman in Zaire, Africa. Muhammad Ali developed Parkinson's disease in the late 80s. He died on June the 3rd, 2016 at the age of 74. Now some questions. Try to answer in a full sentence again. Where did Cassius Clay live? When his bike was stolen, who did he tell? Number three. What did Cassius Clay say to Joe? Number four. What did Joe say? Number five. Was Joe Martin the tennis coach at the Columbia Gym? Number six. What did Cassius Clay learn at the Columbia Gym? Number seven. When he was 15, did he wear rollerblades and dance in the street? Number eight. What did he race? Number nine, did he drink raw eggs in his milk? Number 10, was Cassius Clay very religious? Number 11, when his boxing team went to other towns, what did Cassius Clay always do? Number 12, where did he go for the Olympic trials? Number 13, what did he wear on the aeroplane? Number 14, what did he change his name to? Number 15, the last one, what happened when he refused to go to war in Vietnam? Okay, you've now finished Cassius Clay, Muhammad Ali. Good luck.